In this video tutorial, we will show you how to set up multiple service provider lines on your VVX D230 handsets. As you can see here in our web portal, we have two SP services registered to our VVX D230. However, on all our handsets, the lines being reflected on the display are the SP1 line and the OB line. To ensure all SP services line are reflected on your handsets display, click on DECT Wireless in your web portal. For this demo, we will make the configuration changes on handset 1. Under Settings, locate the parameter name Outbound Services. Uncheck the default value, and add in an SP service that you would like to reflect on your handset's display, to be used for outbound calls. For this case, we will add an RSP2 service. Once you're done with that, hit the Submit button to make the configuration changes. Do the same configuration change for your second handset, which is labeled as Handset 2 in our web portal. Since we have three handsets set up for this demo, we will be doing it for all three handsets. If you wish to add another SP services into your handsets display, simply add them in as currently shown in this video. To change the primary line for one of your handsets, under the primary line parameter, uncheck the default value and select a different SP service to use as your primary line, for this case, we will be using SP2. Once again, hit the submit button. After this, don't forget to hit the reboot button in your web portal to ensure configuration changes will be made. As soon as the device successfully performs a reboot, your handsets should reflect both SP1 and SP2 services along with the OB line on their displays. The SP line ending with 8882 is our SP1 line. As you can see here, our primary line for handset 2 is set to our SP1. If you remembered from earlier in this video, we configured SP2 as our primary line for handset 3. As we navigate to the main display of this handset, you can see that SP2 is the primary line for this handset. If you have more questions about the VVX D230, feel free to reach out to us by leaving a question in the comment section below, or email us at matthew.lee at poly.com. 